Going back to the difference between traditional giveaways or the type of giveaways you've seen on Instagram, Twitter, uh, even on Discord, or this type of giveaway that we're talking about utilizing different software tools, let's get into it. Giveaways. Not just any giveaways, but I like to call them viral giveaway campaigns. And we're going to talk about why and how we can turn these giveaways to become viral and have a much bigger impact and help you convert or reach the end goals of what your campaign is about. So I know you might be familiar with what giveaways are, kind of like sweepstakes. A lot of people run them to get more followers uh, on their Instagram or other social media platforms, or for people to help share their post or their page to have a much bigger reach when it comes to their brand. Now I've been running a lot of giveaways for my clients. I've also used them to help build uh, the audience of one of my other brands called Sastronautics. And we're gonna talk about it in a second because we are currently running a giveaway right now for Sastronautics. So if you do wanna check that out, I'll leave a link in the description below. And I think giveaways, especially the giveaways that I'm gonna talk about right now, some of you might already be aware of what they are, how to run them, what kind of software tools to use. I'm not gonna go into every single software. Uh, I, however, I have used many different SaaS platforms for giveaways. I found uh, one of them in particular uh, to be really good, and I've been using that for clients as well as myself, but you never know. The SaaS industry is so fast. Uh, there's always a better tool coming out. Anyway, that tool is UpViral. I will leave the link there. You can sign up for it and try it out. Um, we've been using UpViral at Sastronautics. I've been using it at my agency for our clients. We have multiple giveaways running right now. And just quick note, if I were ever to restart my agency or start from scratch, um, I, I feel giveaways are the ways that, or giveaway management services is how I would start again. Because one, the impact you have, you can receive on, on giveaways is extremely big. You, you can have a really big impact on there. Um, of course, you need some ad spend to get the ball rolling, or I mean, ad spend or influencers. Uh, to get the ball rolling, but once it starts to roll, uh, it really has this snowball effect, and which is why we put viral on there. Anyway, going back to the difference between traditional giveaways or the type of giveaways you've seen on Instagram, Twitter, uh, even on Discord, or this type of giveaway that we're talking about utilizing different software tools, let's get into it. So let's talk briefly about the difference between the traditional type of giveaway or, or the common giveaways that you've seen on, on Instagram, Twitter, different social media platforms where um, there's not a lot of actions that you can complete and it's based on one platform and one end goal. Of course, the giveaway utilizing different software tools also based on one end goal. However, you can customize it with multiple actions so that you can maximize that campaign. Once that visitor comes in, for example, if you run a giveaway only on Instagram and you ask them, hey, in that Instagram post, uh, hey, go follow our Twitter or do this, do that, uh, they're gonna leave. Uh, you don't want them to leave that social media platform that they're already on, right? However, with this campaign where you utilize different software tools, you're able to build out a landing page uh, and on that social share page. So after a user signs up to your giveaway, you get their email, of course, you wanna integrate that with your email marketing platform to, to grow your list, but they get redirected to a social share page. Now, what is a social share page? Uh, we're gonna, I'm gonna show you on screen in a second, but a social share page basically is each user gets a unique referral link that they can share with their friends, their audience, their family, and every person that signs up to the giveaway using that link, they're gonna be given an extra number of points, whatever you decide to assign that to, ultimately leading them to go up the leaderboard and win that prize, whatever that prize may be. Um, the, the other cool thing about the social share page or whatever you wanna call it, um, this type of giveaway is you can customize the actions for your visitors or your subscribers or participants to complete certain actions that will help them increase their chance of winning. What do those actions mean or what, what can they be? They can be pretty much anything. So the more creative you are with it, the more fun it is for the participants, the better it is for you. Uh, we'll see how we can get creative about that by showing off the current session artist giveaway running right now. But uh, just to give you an example, you know, follow our Instagram, of course, uh, follow our, our follow us on Twitter, like our Facebook page, like this post, share this post, leave a comment on why you want to win this prize and hashtag XYZ and tag us, blah, 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 blah. So there's a lot you can do there and we're going to dive straight in. So give me a second. Let me share my screen. All right. So I have the currently using the current giveaway for Sastronautics open and I am using UpViral. 
Upviral is an awesome SaaS tool. I think um, I'll leave the link. It's upviral.com, I believe. Uh, I'll leave a link in the description. So I have it currently on a C name because of my own subdomain. If you don't use your own subdomain, especially for clients, obviously they're gonna see the software that you're using. Um, if you wanna be, I mean, you wanna be transparent with your clients, but also from the client side, when they run that giveaway to their audience, you don't want to show them up viral. You want them to show the client's domain. Anyway, so giveaway.sashronautics.com. If you're looking to win an M1 MacBook Air, go check that out right now. It's still live as of today, ending on May 21st, 2021. And if you're watching this from the future and this giveaway is over, don't worry. We like. I really love giveaways. They really help us grow. Also, our participants have a better chance of winning. Um, or many chances of winning. So we continue to run these giveaways often. Now, you'll see this page, uh, Upviral, they have the landing page. And again, as I mentioned, the social share page, but that landing page, uh, they just made an update recently, maybe a few weeks ago, and they have a drag and drop builder. So the drag and drop builder makes it super easy for you to build out your landing pages, make them pretty. Um, but you'll notice here that this is very beautiful. Well, I think it's very beautiful. Props to Gerard, our designer at Sashronautics. And uh, maybe in another video, I'll explain how you can, you know, make the most of that drag and drop builder. The headline, super simple. Enter for a chance to win MacBook Air, the M1 MacBook Air. Uh, and then we have a video which was done by Shannon also on our Sashonautics team. Uh, go check it out. And anyway, on that landing page, we like to obviously write about what the giveaway is, what you can win, the things that the visitor would care about, right? They're not really gonna care about you as a brand. So we keep that a little bit lower in the page. The other thing is we add in some action or uh, some more details on other prizes people can win, right? So for example, in this giveaway, we have, uh, we're giving away certain percentage discount codes based on the number of points that they win. So we call them milestones in UpViral. You might, um, any other software tools that you're using that also has some like this I don't know it might be called something else but milestones here um, and the reason why we're not just giving away one M1 MacBook Air is because uh, someone like me if you check my YouTube and you see how many subscribers I have I don't have many I don't have a big audience right uh, and so when a giveaway is done and then the prize is given to the user or the participant with the highest number of points most likely the person if, if someone's an influencer they're gonna win Right, so I don't usually, personally, I don't usually join those. I like to join the ones where there's a lot of random winners, um, but I also, but that doesn't mean I join every single one that has random winners. If the main prize is given to a random winner, I'm not joining because sometimes a lot of funny stuff happens. Anyway, um, with random winners and multiple prizes for you know first the twentieth place or something like that, uh, I know I have a better chance of winning, so I want to join in. For example, our last giveaway at Sashronautics, we gave away 100-something prizes uh, relevant to our, uh, our brand. So we gave away a lot of software tools. And we thought that was fun. That was highly successful. So hopefully, this one can be just as successful. Anyway, on the landing page, uh, we, we find out what we can win, you know, what it is. Of course, it's attractive, keep, uh, keeps the visitor's attention. All right, so I want to I wanna join in. So we have on our page, you can add in buttons using the UpViral drag and drop builder. I have a button to participate here. I have another one somewhere down the page here and another one at the very bottom, right? Um, so when we join, there's two ways to join uh, for UpViral. On UpViral, you have the social sign-in. So you can use Facebook um, or you can do email, right? The two differences would be with social sign-in, it's much more difficult to cheat the system because it's tied directly to their Facebook ID. However, um, you also lose out on a lot of people because Facebook, not everyone's on Facebook uh, or they don't want to share that information even though Facebook shares a lot of information or takes a lot of information. Anyway, I'm going to sign in with my email. Um, let me find one I'm not using. All right, so that was the landing page and we... After the landing page, so they, they're opting in, right? So they're, they want to join the giveaway, so they participate. In order to participate, they need to sign up. So what that sign up is, the sign up is to the giveaway, but on UpViral, on the back end, what you're doing is you're integrating that with your email marketing platform. For us at Sessionautics, at this particular campaign, which is for Sessionautics, we're using Modic and Clavio. So we have Modic in the front uh, because we get a lot of leads, but a lot of those emails uh, might not be very uh, relevant to our audience or relevant to our business. And so we kind of weed them out with different automations. And we'll go, I'll go into that in a quick second. But um, yeah, we tie it with a Modic. And so now we get their email as well. So that's one part. One part already done in the giveaway, which might be if one of your goals are growing your email list, which you would most likely want to do, um, done, right? So as soon as they join in, we got their email. 
For this campaign, we have double opt-in, so they need to confirm or verify their email, and now we're on that page. So on this page, now we have what I was referring to earlier as the social share page. Now on the social share page, we have that unique referral link. Now this is the link that people can share with their friends, with their family, with their audience, on social media, by email, SMS maybe. And whenever somebody joins this giveaway through this link, they are winning more points. So every user will be able to see how many points they have up here every time they join in. The other thing is if they've signed up for the giveaway, every time they go to the link giveaway.sashronautics.com, they're automatic because they're already participating. They're automatically redirected to this page, the social share page. So it makes it very easy. Uh, and you see here, we have assigned 50 points for every successful sign up from the unique referral link. Uh, but that's completely up to you. You can sign in 100, 1000, whatever you want. Now, what we've done here, which is a little different from what you might have seen in our last giveaway, if you've seen it or maybe some other people's giveaways, we've broken down the actions, which I had mentioned earlier. Uh, with a clear goal or a clear number of points that they can achieve and win and what they can do. So here we've broken down my images. These are uh, PNG images. Earn 100 points by doing completing these. And then you can earn another 260 points by doing these. 670 points by doing these. And then we have those milestones on the side. And another fun thing, I, I mentioned earlier that, you know, the more creative you are with these actions, because you can get very creative. These actions are customizable uh, completely, whatever, whichever way you want to do it. So for us, for this giveaway, we kind of thought about it, brainstormed a little bit. You know, we don't have a lot of money, but we figured cash prices, something everyone's interested in. And we did uh, mini like contests, right? We did mini contests within our giveaway. So, you know, one of the two ways to really help grow your social media or your awareness, your brand presence would be giveaways. That's a great one. Uh, one of my favorites. And then we thought contests as well. Contest, a lot of people do mini contests uh, on Discord, on Facebook, uh, Twitter. And so we were like, you know, why don't we just combine both of them? So we have mini contests in here and I'll go through it in a second. Um, so then one of the first things up here is, of course, you want to share the giveaway so people can share the giveaway, what's happening, share it on Twitter, on LinkedIn. There's more you can add here. Uh, we just added, you know, the main channels that we find our audience on or our buyers personas on and we've assigned a certain number of points. Scrolling down, we've added more actions here. For us, uh, you, you can probably tell what is important to us here by the number of points that we have assigned. But our Facebook community, so our Facebook group, we had really wanted to grow uh, for quite some time. So we put that up front, up top. Uh, our YouTube channel, uh, also something we want to grow. Our Instagram, not so much. So we have it at 20 points, like our Facebook page and so on and so forth. So you see where this is going, right? With the way the giveaway works, everyone wants to win that prize. Of course, you want to make it attractive. But the actions that you fulfill here are going to help grow everything, every channel or whatever you assign to it. So for example, I have a client, or sorry, my agency, we have a client that really wants to grow their Twitter in Korea. Uh, in, in Korea, Twitter, not so powerful, but uh, that's what they wanted to do. So what we had done here is we just removed everything else. We removed Facebook, LinkedIn, Messenger, Facebook communities, and we tied everything into Twitter. So even with these customized actions, it's not just follow us on Twitter, but tweet at us, you know, tweet your favorite ice cream flavor and hashtag, you know, ice cream and tag us, right? Um, and tweet at us. So there's a million different things, possibilities that you can do here. And ultimately you need to define what your goal is for this giveaway before you plan all of this out. And then down here, we have a few more customized actions. For example, we wanted them to create an account at Sastronautics, even if they don't buy anything. We have, we wanted more traffic to our blog because we, we put out a lot of valuable information. We wanted them to read our article and leave a comment, right? So we get to know who they are, we get some more engagement, so on and so forth. You also see here, we have comment on this YouTube video. Of course, we want them to engage with us on YouTube as well because YouTube is actually the platform we are now planning to move all of our webinars to. Anyway, now scrolling back up, we talked about those little mini contests. So we have some mini contests over here where they can win additional prizes, right? Even if they won the M1 MacBook, they're still eligible for these prizes. So now we have $50 in cash for the best blog post review. What does that do for us? Of course, with the participant, they're able to potentially win $50 in cash. For us, our goal is to get more reviews uh, on, on you know, Google search on the internet. And so a blog post review would be great for one of our deals. And of course, purchasing a deal, a software deal on Sastronautics is not mandatory. So we're not forcing them to do a review of a deal. They can also review our website. They can review who we are, Sastronautics, which is a quick glance through. And if they found the giveaway, most likely they already know who we are. Best meme, 
fifty dollars in cash. These are always fun. A lot of engagement, uh, and it's been doing pretty well. And then Facebook reviews, ten dollars in cash, and so on and so forth. Now earlier on that landing page, we had additional uh, prizes for milestones, right? Smaller prizes. Uh, those milestones are referring to the ones here. So we're giving out discount codes for purchases on our website because that is, you know, who we're looking for, who we're targeting. We're targeting people that want to buy that, that use software or SaaS for their business, for their freelancing career, or whatever the case is. Especially today, everyone being online, we have these discount codes for each. Uh, milestone and which what is a milestone here in this giveaway a milestone is x number of points so when somebody completes uh, some of these actions that have 500 points they, they're able to unlock a five percent discount code so on and so forth uh, throughout the campaign so that's pretty much a quick summary of how we uh, how I like to run giveaways utilizing some of these awesome tools out there again uh, props to up viral for creating an awesome tool and continuing to update it and upgrade it uh, according to their user base and their user feedback. And so before we had done giveaways at our agency when we were doing a lot of social media, I mean, we still do social media marketing, but when we were doing a lot of social media marketing for clients, uh, we would do these giveaways that were based on an Instagram post, sharing this Instagram post, taking a selfie, uploading it and talk uh, and writing a caption about why they want to win whatever X number prize. However, Every time we did a giveaway on these platforms, whether it's Twitter or, or, or Facebook, Instagram, or some of the Korean platforms for our Korean clients, there was only one, really one or two actions that we can ask them to complete, right? Share the campaign, share the giveaway, uh, tag us, hashtag this. However, with finding out about all these software tools for giveaways, and I've used almost every single one out there, we were able to expand on that first, on that visitor, right? So when a visitor joins or the, when a visitor participates in the giveaway, we're able to get them to do a lot more actions, hence maximizing the impact that we have on each uh, giveaway, on each lead. So if you're looking to increase your social media presence, your brand presence, your brand awareness, uh, one of the things that really helps give you traction and a jumpstart for a much lower price would be giveaways. And I, and I, I really believe that every company or almost every B2C company should definitely utilize giveaway campaigns and not just simple giveaways or the traditional type of giveaways or sweepstakes that we had talked about, but utilizing some of these SaaS tools or these software platforms for giveaways uh, in order to maximize what you can get from each participant. And of course, you're giving away a great attractive prize that's relevant to your campaign. Um, so one risk, not necessarily a risk, but a kind of downside or something that you're going to face in every giveaway and everyone that runs a giveaway faces is the, the, the leads that you get, not every single one of them is going to be relevant to your audience. Let's say you're giving away, or for us, an M1 MacBook Air, everybody wants an Air, uh, MacBook Air. Um, one of the other ones we did for a luxury resort, uh, that was one of our clients was a, a free flight. This was pre COVID of course, a free flight to Korea at a luxury hotel, five-star hotel hotel, two nights and one romantic dinner for two, right? Uh, and of course, in Southeast Asia and Asia, other parts of the world, every, a lot of people want to fly to Korea. And we had a ton of leads. Now, are all those leads relevant to the company? No, they were not. With the M1 MacBook Air, I already know now, probably 15, 20% of the leads that we get at Sessionautics, they're not going to care about software. So how do we weed them out? So you do want to weed them out because you don't want to, you don't want them to stay in your email marketing. They're not opening up your emails. God forbid they click on spam. So what we do on at Session Audits and for our clients is we set up automations to kind of weed them out. So we'll segment them into a separate list for all the giveaway leads. We'll set up some automations and some rules where if they don't open our email after, let's just say, for example, two, two or three emails, uh, even with the follow-ups, then we will remove them from our list, right? So that is one way to clear that up and make sure that you're not missing out on all of that. You, you do want to keep paying attention to your email list uh, and keep that nice and clean because it's not about the size. It is the quality of your audience. If I can pick, I would rather have 1,000 email uh, leads or 1,000 emails in my list, 1,000 subscribers in my list that all open my email, engage with me, reply to me, than having 100,000 with 85% not caring. Uh, I hope this was helpful. I'm going to make more videos. This was my first one in a long time. So I hope you enjoyed it. And don't forget to check out the Session Artist giveaway. We're giving away that awesome M1 MacBook Air. I need one. Thank you.